Alfie and I are sat in the car now and the film is playing. Now bring us some piggy oh, pudding. Now bring us some piggy pudding. That's good. <laughs> hey, shit, I'm going to choke on my food. Good afternoon everybody, it is currently Thursday, so this is going to be a two day vlog because all of this morning I had a lot of my, I always call them big business meetings, so I have them every month which is a meeting with my business advisor, my accountant, my lawyer and Maddie who is obviously my manager and we go through finances, outgoings, incomings basically everything um and this was our end of year and so it was a very big important one and um that's what i've been doing all morning and that isn't the funnest of vlog i'm not gonna lie it's gonna be a bit of a shorter one this thursday but i'm really excited for the evening because every year i get so what's going on with my tv i can hear it but there's nothing on it every year we put something together for all of our employees and everyone we work with and it's usually a highlight for me i love it it really it's one of those days or evenings that puts me in the festive spirit and this year has been really tough on everyone but it's been particularly weird not getting to work with the group of people that I work with. And I love having the office space, I love bouncing off of people, I love that vibe of like the team being together. And it's obviously not been like that this year because of COVID and everybody working from home. So more than ever, I feel like it's needed, but it has to be done in a safe way. And for a while we were like toying like, we just can't do anything, like there's nothing we can, hello, there is nothing we can do that is safe, um, that is allowed, uh, it might just be something we have to completely strike off altogether, which sucks, so we just thought there must be something else that we can do, where we can all be there, it can feel festive, it can be a really nice thing that's still safe, um, and then we thought, let's see if we can do the Tully's drive-in cinema. We went there, was it last month? Maybe two months ago for one of the Halloween viewings and it was so good. You just drive in, you stay in your car, it's so safe. Um, and I just felt like that was such a good idea and something that everybody could do and feel comfortable in the knowledge that they can stay in their car and they're not coming into contact with anybody. But we're all sort of still there. We can all like wave at each other, um, put our gifts like on the bonnets of the cars um, and still get to experience something together and hopefully get people in the festive spirit. So that is what we're doing tonight i've also got um little sacks with a little snack box so everybody will get one of those i think we've got some pjs um we've got some bits and pieces from skinny dip i believe i know that chelsea peers have very kindly sent over pajamas for everybody um and it i just i think that it's it's the best we can make of this situation and i'm I'm actually really, really excited. Even though it's very, very different from the Christmas parties we usually have where we're all sharing and singing into a microphone, which definitely isn't what we will be doing this year. Um, at least we're still able to kind of be near each other and to celebrate. Uh, the Grey's boxes look amazing. They're done by Stylish Eats, um, which is the company that um, Alfie and I have used over the years for any little grazing bits. I'm excited. I'm glad we picked Home Alone and actually because we have just told people to come and stay in their cars we've also just said like bring a plus one like bring your other half like so our accountant and our lawyer are coming with their kids as well which will be so cute. So I think this afternoon 
I'm gonna pack up the sacks to take over to people and that's my little update and I'm excited for you to to witness the drive-in cinema experience. It's a little bit later and I have finished wrapping all of most of the team's presents. Um, turning everything off as we're about to head to Tully's farm or Tully's drive-in. I'm also just really excited to properly sit and watch Home Alone because I've had it on in the background but I've not properly sat and watched it so I'm excited about that. Taking a throw. You might laugh at this but I bought these throws last year and I ordered so many of them that I knew I could keep some unopened and open them again this year in case they didn't bring any new ones out. Uh, excuse me, no, no, no. You've got your little outside feet on my brand new throw. Get off. So I'm going to take this. I don't know whether we'll be sitting outside oh, because there is an option to sit outside your car um, to get a better view or if I'll just use this and snuggle up in the car. We shall see. Are you excited? I'm actually very excited. It's gonna be good, isn't it? I feel like we couldn't have done a better Christmas work party, even if 2020 pandemic wasn't happening. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, it's like, so this fun. Is such a sick Christmas party, whatever. Yeah. Let alone it's also social distancing, it's amazing. Right, let's go. Let's hit the road. We're here. We've got some food, we've got our little... He just read me back the food, I forgot how good it is. He's like, did you get the cheese and bacon burger, the cheese burger? Oh. Cheese with extra, extra. And look at the screen. A to Z together again for Christmas. That's cool, isn't it? Yeah. Everyone's here. I don't want to film everyone's number plates, but... Yeah! Alfie and I are sat in the car now and the film is playing. How fun is this? This is literally the dream evening. We've ordered some food. So they've got these, which are the most insane thing I've ever eaten. These are chips with cheese and bacon bits and they taste like those crisps frazzles. And then there's a burger, cheeseburger. Oh cheese my god, oh my god, that looks insane. And then I just went for normal cheese fries, which I'm regretting now. Oh really, do you want some of these? I'll just go for one more of yours. Got a cheeky little burger. We made up these little stockings for everybody. Well, Hessian sack. I feel like I've said Hessian sack a lot in this I've moment. I've never heard you say Hessian sack. <laughs> I said ever it the in your day. life so until this, these this is actually alfie's one i've got mine behind but this is the one with our snacks in it are you ready this is, I, I haven't even finished eating my burger yet and we're already getting onto the snack <laughs> look at this she's done us a movie treat box so we've got homemade guacamole and salsa with nachos iced lemon iced shortbread Ooh. Salted caramel popcorn and a selection of sweets and chocolate. <laughs> oh, even the ribbon looks like... Movie. Oh my God, look at this. She's just so talented, isn't she? She's so The box is a bit warped. We've broken the box, but you know what? How do you open it? I think it's the other side. How do I open it? I think it? it's like this, and then I think, look, and then the watch, it slides out. That's so nice. Oh. Oh my. This looks good. We can put it here in the middle if you want. Yeah. So we can put it there. Chips and dip. That's what I was really after. Popcorny. We've got some water. Some more popcorn. Oh, it's falling out a bit. Water. This is yours. I'm showing you. Some more chocolate. And Look then, at this. Look. This is what makes me excited. Yeah, I know. Zoe and Alfie's chocolate. So good. Sorry about that. Chelsea Piers sent some pyjamas and me and you have got matching. Look, how nice are these? Feel how soft. 
So me and you have got matching. Not just me and you. And Nala's got matching. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking on the chocolate. Yay! Now bring us some picky oh, pudding. That. Now bring us some picky pudding and bring some right here. Yeah, <laughs> he's flashing the lights. Muddy and Joel. <laughs> Hello, everybody. It's Friday. It's Friday then. It's Friday, Sunday, what? So today, been a bit of a slow start to the day. I'm not gonna lie. Um, woke up again quite early with Nala. My little precious bean. Alfie took her to the vets. All is good with her leg, so we're really, really happy about that. The bandage is still on. Oh, focus. She's got a new one. She's got a blue one this time. Look at her, she's down there. Um, but her leg is healing really well. I believe they took out the stitches. So that's really positive. Nice positive start to Friday. Last night was so good. I absolutely loved it and everybody else really loved it as well and we've had lots of messages today of everyone saying like that was the most festive I felt like all month um, and to be honest it I feel like it was one of the most festive things we've been able to do as well so I really 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 loved it and uh, it just felt so safe everyone was kind of in their cars or sat outside their car um, and Home Alone is just such a good film such a good film we've still got some snacks left over actually so i've been picking out of that grazing box all day the tully's drive-in cinema so good i actually think a drive-in cinema needs to be more of a permanent thing um obviously um lots of them have kind of popped up as an alternative to being able to go to the actual cinema this year but i know that drive-in cinemas are already quite big or quite a thing in america but not really here uh, but it's definitely the sort of thing I would just do as and when any time um, I, I love it. It's such a cool thing to just be able to like cozy up in your car and just feel like you're in your own little Your own little World watching a film highly recommend if you've not done that today much like yesterday is uh, Sort of tying a lot of things up. This is Alfie's last day of work Which he's very excited about um, before signing off for Christmas um, and I think that's the same for a lot of people um, so it's been very quiet <laughs> on all fronts I'm really really excited it feels like a Friday like it really feels like a Friday today sorry I just started drinking some coke and that was not good timing so because we weren't all able to like really socialize or talk much last night we are doing a team zoom um, at four o'clock, which is why I'm wearing something festive. The dress code is dress to impress, so that's what I aim to do. <laughs> We're gonna do um, a number of different things. We have another little grazing board that we've sent out to everybody. I think this one is like a little charcuterie board. So there's cheese and there's meats and like lots of little bits and pieces, which uh, I'm very excited for. So people have got those and a little bottle of Prosecco as well to drink. Um, for us to all cheers, uh, cheers the year away. <laughs> Just wish each other a Merry Christmas. So I'm really excited about that. It's actually been a while since I've done a Zoom quiz and I believe that Holly has put together the most epic of all Christmas quizzes. Um, so I'm excited about that. And Alfie and I are going to give awards to specific people that, um, in like really funny kind of just comedic categories so we've got little like trophies to give people which i'm excited to do um so yeah i just think it's going to be a nice a nice little wholesome hour and a half of just wishing each other a merry christmas and eating food i have not written a single christmas card yet this year and i'm in two minds about whether i should or shouldn't because is it too late? I don't know. I like writing Christmas cards. I like the the task of writing Christmas cards. And I myself am a cards person. I love when someone writes me a card. Um, words are my love language. Words of affirmation. Oh, let me know what yours is. And if you've not ever done the love language test, 
you should definitely go and check it out. I think you just have to search like love language quiz online maybe and it comes up. Um, so I am words of affirmation. So I love words. Words to me are my thing. And what was yours actually, Alf? Do you remember yours? My what? Your love language. Was... Quality time. Yeah. So Alfie's is quality time and mine is words of affirmation. To be honest though, I feel like I need to redo it. I wonder if it would still be the same. I think I did it about two or three years ago. So I do wonder, but I do know I like words, which is why I also really cherish cards and other people's time and thoughts and efforts into a card. Um, I would honestly just be happy if all I got for Christmas day was cards from people. <laughs> I love them and I'm one of these people that can never throw any cards away which is just I mean does everyone have that drawer in their kitchen that's just full of random shit because ours is full of cards that's like our card drawer our card drawer and batteries and like torches and like tape measures and stuff but I really value a card but I haven't written any which is bad I don't know do I start now? If I wrote cards now and sent them, would they actually get there before Christmas? That is the question. While we wait for the Zoom to begin, I thought I would share with you the fact that I found a Twix winter spice. Oh, extra, what does that mean? It's longer than normal. I bought four of them actually, because I was like, if I like these and then I can't find them anywhere, I'm gonna be really annoyed. They're so good really good it's quite like a synthetic -y festive spice flavor but i'm not complaining i quite like it that's good try it i found this in um where did i get this in, in a garage very happy with that i like that you've just adopted this chair over here <laughs> i sat in it when it used to be where the tree was i feel like it's like if I sit on the sofa, I get too comfortable and I don't end up getting any work done. If I sit in this chair, it just makes me sit properly. <laughs> um, I even said in my vlog the other day, we need to move that into the conservatory. <laughs> but it doesn't look like we're going to. Your, mum, like it, your yeah. mum will want to sit in that on Christmas yeah. Day. It's quite a nice one. Try this festive Twix. What are these? I saw these in the other room. You bought like five of them or something. Yeah, try it. It's a festive, festive Twix. Whoa. Do you like it? Or do you not like it? I don't know. I wasn't sure if you would like cinnamon. it or not. Yeah, it's like cinnamony. It's festive spice. Oh, winter spice. Keep calling it festive spice. I like spice. it. But I prefer normal. Do you? But I do like it. It's funny, isn't it? I'm still going to eat them, aren't I? Really sick. I mean, you did just eat the last it. bit of mine. <laughs> oh, was that the last bit? It's all right. I've got three more. <laughs> we are Christmas Zoom party ready. Are you ready? I think I'm ready. Have you got my little bat? Oh, yeah. yes. Now I'm ready. Look at this. Prosecco. Oh, I think I might just save this for dreams. Christmas. Because I don't think I'm going to drink all of that. Have we all... Wait, we've got a bottle each. Yeah. <laughs> Should we pop it? Go on then. I feel like we need to join the call. And then we... pop it. Pop it in the call. Um, just quickly. This is another little grazing box by Katie at Stylish Eats. Let me show you what's in here before we start this call. Oh my gosh. Cheese, brie, cheddar, stilton, salami, prosciutto, prosciutto, pigs in blankets, olives with feta and sun-dried tomatoes, salted caramel brownie, gingerbread men, meringue kisses. Oh my god, this. Oh, Look at this. Does it say what's in there? Yes. <gasps> oh my. Oh. Is that a little pot of honey? What is that? A little pot of chutney? I'm so happy we don't have to share. Honey. Oh, look at that. That looks so good. And everybody who's joining the call has one of those as well. Let's put this down and jump in. Are you eating already? Start. Let's get in this call. Is this open? Yeah. Hey. Hey, they are. Hello. Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas. the animals. <laughs> Dave, I'm loving. Oh, Nala! Nala's gone in me Grey's box. Dave, I'm loving the wig. Thank you, thank you. So here's only missing one ingredient from his outfit. That's all. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh Wait. nice! 
face to him. To him. Put it on a okay. Pod. Okay then. <laughs> Bloody hell. I feel like we should have done that. So we crack it open now then, yeah? We've just opened ours. Yeah, we've just opened ours. Cheers. 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 How many laps of his garden did Captain Tom Moore walk? <laughs> Wait, I know how many, wait, did you say how many miles or how many laps? How many laps? Of his garden. <laughs> what? How big is oh. his garden? Have you just looked at my answer? Personal question, Dan. Hey, shit, I'm going to choke on my food. <laughs> if you saw Zoe's answer, <laughs> Zoe's written <laughs> more that any of us could walk in 48 hours if we even tried. <laughs> She's written such a big amount. I crossed that out, I didn't mean to put that. <laughs> it is now the evening. I'm in bed, but not like ready for bed. <laughs> um, look, we've got our little Christmas tree bedding. And um, I'm literally just on my phone doing a couple of worky bits on the Zoella website and watching the holiday and I've done my skincare routine for the evening so I'm feeling fresh and ready for bed but I wanted to come on here and end the vlog properly because I could feel myself like falling asleep and I was like no thank you so much for watching I feel like this vlog has just been a lot of talking um but it's been a fun couple of days I really feel like now the year is like ending it's like really rounding off and everyone's going to be going off and enjoying their Christmas holidays. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to sleep well tonight. <laughs> but I hope you enjoyed this vlog and I'll see you again tomorrow. Night night.